Good morning, Beaver High. I'm Hollis. And I'm Jordan. Today is Wednesday, December 4th. And you're watching Beaver High's Morning News. Book return for all TCL students will take place December 4th through the 6th after 2 p.m. Please return all TCL books to Miss Miola in the guidance department. The College Board will sponsor a free workshop for students and parents who want to learn more about planning for college and the free resources available to assist with the planning. The workshop will be tomorrow at 6 p.m. at Bluffton High School Performing Arts Center. Foods and Nutrition 1, 1st and 3rd Blocks are at war this week. Cupcake Wars, that is. The theme is Holiday Joy. Teachers will taste test on Wednesday and students will judge on the visual presentation. Use the QR code to see pictures of the displays. You can also vote by viewing the displays at the end of the school from Wednesday to Friday in the Kate Showcase, next to Mr. Shervin's room. Top Kitchen Group will win gift cards. Support your faves and help us pick the ones who did it best. There will be a parent and traveler information meeting on Tuesday, December 10th from 6 to 7 p.m. in Mr. Miller's room, room 1230. For anyone interested in a field trip to New Zealand, Australia, and Hawaii, the trip will be in July 2021. There will be a parent and traveler informational meeting on Thursday, December 12th from 6 to 7 p.m. in Mr. Miller's room 1230. For anyone interested in going on a trip that includes New York City and Washington, D.C. for the presidential inauguration in January 2021, please see Mr. Miller by Friday to RSVP. Spots are limited. The sophomore class will be selling cookies outside the cafeteria the week before Christmas break. Cookies will be two for one dollar. The Sports Medicine 2 class conducted a fantasy football league. Unlike the real fantasy football leagues, this league tracked injuries to the drafted players. The trick was to predict which players would be injury free during the season. A variety of points were given if players were injured, starting with 10 points for a surgery, 7 points for a missing a game, 5 points for being injured if in a game, 4 points for missing practice, 3 points for being listed as doubtful for the game, and 2 points for being limited in practice. The champion over the course of the 10 weeks was a student with the least amount of points. This year's champion is Emini Legree. Her wise choices of Matt Ryan, Devonta Freeman, Ezekiel Elliott, Julio Jones, Calvin Ridley, Austin Hooper, and Matt Bryant allowed her to win the league with ease. Congratulations, Emini. The Art 3 and Art 4 Honors class will be hosting reception for the new art show on Tuesday, December 10th in the Gallery of the Reforming Arts Center from 6 to 8 p.m. If you cannot come out on Tuesday, the gallery will be open during all holiday performances. Make sure to drop by and view the talent these students express through their art. The Spanish National Honor Society is coordinating a service project called Samaritan's Purse. They're accepting donations of hygiene products, small toys, socks, school supplies, reusable water bottles, and other goods small enough to fit in a shoebox for children in impoverished countries. Donation boxes are located in the front office and in guidance. Get ready for the annual Crazy Ugly Holiday Sweater Contest sponsored by Interact. Beginning the week of December 9th, students may buy wristbands to wear a sweater on Thursday, December 12th. Upload a picture of you wearing the sweater to enter the contest. The top three sweaters will win a prize. All proceeds will be donated to help those in need during the holidays. Join our Google Classroom using the code KJNDPI to learn more and enter the contest. Interact is asking for donations of stocking stuffers for elderly and youth in need during the holidays. Items can be delivered to Miss Kid anytime before December 5th. Please label donations with your name and designate which group your items are for. See the image on screen for donation suggestions. The Freshman Student Council are hosting a spirit night at Moe's on December 10th from 5 to 9. A portion of the proceeds will be donated to the Freshman Student Council. Hope to see you there! Kirkland Crazy t-shirts for the upcoming basketball season are on sale for $15. With the purchase of a t-shirt, you'll be able to participate in special promotions like a jeans day with a t-shirt on December 6th when we host Battery Creek. Other promotions will follow. See Coach Huff or Coach Shervin to purchase a t-shirt and show your pride. Seniors who wish to apply for the National Honor Society Scholarship must do so before the deadline of December 10th. See Ms. Lacombe for details. Membership drive for Spanish National Honor Society is going on this week. See a Spanish teacher or the table at lunch for more information and an application. DECA members competing at regional competition will meet tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. in the front of the school. Arrive dressed in business attire. Freshman Student Council will be doing a raffle from December 10th through 12th during all lunch days for five students to win three no uniform days. There will also be a staff raffle for three staff members to win three jean days. 
Tickets will be $1 for one or $5 for six. Fellowship of Christian Athletes will meet Friday morning at 810 in a small auditorium. Hey Eagles, Emmett here with your sports news. The Buford Eagles wrestling team sprang into action last night traveling to Somerville. The Eagles opened the season going 2-1 and one in the Somerville quad. They opened with a tough loss to Somerville by a score of 54-28, to 28, but then rebounded by defeating Hanahan 48-36 and Swansea 54-30. Leading the way for the Eagles was Theo Washington going 3-0 on the night with three pins. Matthew Durant was 2-0 with two pins, and Michael Sensi was 2-0 with one pin. Newcomers Brendan Glover scored two victories with two pins, Terrence Wilson was 2-0 with the pin, while Devin Langfelt, Colton Ferris, Josh Warren, and Adam Bervinich all scored pins during the night. The Eagles' next action will be this Friday and Saturday, December 6th and 7th, at the May River Invitational. Softball winter practice will begin December 9th, 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Any girls interested in playing softball in the spring are encouraged to come out and practice. Varsity girls and boys basketball will play Somerville in the nest at 6 and 7.30. That's your sports news. Go Eagles! Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for a moment of silence. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.